G'day YouTubers, David here. In this video I'm just going to show you how to download and install Visual Studio. Visual Studio is a, uh, a software that um, is used to create um, applications for computers, um, mobile phones and tablets. So simply just want to head to your um, search engine, type in Visual Studio and search. Simply click on downloads. And we're going to download the Visual Studio Community 2017. It's a free download. Simply click on the free download. This will take a fair few minutes to install. Okay, we get sent to this page. And it's already started, so what we do is simply click Run. Now this page that it sent you to here has just got a lot of information. Good idea to have a look through. Just ask me if I'd like to set it up. I said yes, and uh, yeah. So just simply have a have a browse through, and um, you can learn a fair bit about it. So as this um, starts to download, it'll open up, and then we'll be able to see some other um, sections in there that we can download and install to the Visual Studio uh, application. Okay. So I'm just going to pause as we go along. And we'll go from there. Okay, it's starting to finish its download. We'll go for the setup. So it's just going to close down the internet. As you can see here, it pops up and it shows us a whole bunch of um, extras that we can we can add on as well. Okay, so each one of these. Um, extras uh, is has a purpose okay so to start with I'm going to be downloading universal uh, Windows platform now that's for creating anything to do with uh, Windows so that can be desktop applications tablets and mobile phones okay and we'll be working in uh, C sharp VB JavaScript and uh, C++ okay we also have um, .NET development for Windows Forms okay so I'm going to download that and we've got desktop deployment with um, C++ okay and things like that and we've got ASP now ASP is um, used for internet applications and websites okay so for what I'm doing I'm not going to be using that I'm going to be downloading the tools I need to create uh, mobile applications so desktop and um, tablets and mobile okay we've got um, Azure de development tools uh, you've got Python and Node um, data storage options um, Office SharePoints um, mobile development game development and um, mobile development with um, C++ and yeah so you've got plenty there that you can choose from now what I'll be using is I'll be using Xamarin okay so that is for iOS Android and Windows mobile so I'll be clicking on that to download and let me just have a look here see if there's anything else I might need you can always come back and add these ones later okay now as you can see it tells you the size of it and this is their size 34 gig okay because I'm downloading these three options you can as I said you can always come back and install them later so I'm just going to click install you can you can also just focus on the basic ones uh, at the top there just for Windows but um, now Windows Visual Studio here has come out and they're able to help create uh, applications for Android and iOS devices all in the the one software so that's why Visual Studios is actually a really good um, software okay so as you can see you've got enterprise and professional we're just using the community 2017 and this is a free version so this is going to take probably your 40 40 minutes or more to uh, download and install and then we'll take it from there
Okay, now that it's finished uh, downloading and installing, we just simply click launch. That's going to open up Visual Studios and take us through a few more steps. We can close the back page down now. Now it's going to ask if we want to sign in or sign up. In this case, I'm just going to click not now, maybe later. All right, and it's just going to start putting things together. You can uh, now pick the layout that you want, the design. It's just going to stick with standard and click start Visual Studio. And this will just take a few minutes to load everything up. Alrighty, ready to roll. So this is our main page here, and you can simply go through and find out some information about it. Once you open up the project, you'll find your recent projects here. Okay, so just to start, I'll just give us a quick quick run through. If you want to start a new project, simply click File, go to New, and then go to Project. From here, you'll be able to um, decide what type of odd um, projects you're going to be building and I'll show you that in a second once it loads up there's various types of templates that you can use and uh, deciding on the operating systems that you're going to be building for okay so here we have all sorts okay we've got visual C sharp we've got Windows Universal Okay, now this is for blank apps. As you can see here, they're all for um, uh, different screen sizes. Um, you've also got Android, got phone apps and watch apps and so on and so forth. And you can also for Apple products. Okay, if you expand, you can see you've got Apple Watch, iPads, iPhones, and Universal. Okay, so there's a bit of a, an idea of how to download and install Visual Studio. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to download and install uh, Visual Studio Android Emulator. Okay, and that works so when we build a, a mobile application, you're able to run it on your screen as in, the, in a mobile phone form or tablet form. Okay, to see exactly how your layout uh, is and your design setup. So that'll be in the next video and I'll also be making a few videos on building some basic applications for Android, Windows and Apple as well. So yeah, follow up on the next few videos guys and I'll see you then.